you, bless you, bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My name is Apostle Peter Daniel by the grace of God. You are watching me in heaven and hell by the grace of God. The one we used to do every Sunday now. Uh, we have changed the time to Sunday. Sunday by 9 a.m. Uh, the, uh, the Thursday, Thursday by the grace of God. Why we do our Sabbath service on Saturday. So we have shifted our Sabbath service to Saturday, not Sunday any longer. So we are now having, we are now having heaven and hell on Sunday to Thursday by the grace of God. Uh, the Lord bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ as you are watching me. It is very important to press the subscribe button and notification button so as you can receive more revelational and more uh, messages so that you too can be saved and be delivered at the end of the age. Thank you. Uh, before we go, let us pray. Our everlasting Father, we want to thank you for everything you have done for us. We want to give you honor, all adorations, all power to you only. Because to you all authority belongs to you. Be thou glorified and exalted in Jesus' name. Our Lord and our God, our King, our glory. We ask you, O Lord God, that you fill our heart with your word. And you will toss every heart that listens and hear. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We ask you, O Lord, to destroy every satanic plantation in every heart here in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' powerful name we have prayed. Amen. God bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' name. Uh, by the special grace of God, we are going to teach on our topic today, deceptions in the church. I pray we will not go to hell in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Deceptions in the church are... Um, by the grace of God, something happened to me about yesterday and uh, I was thinking about it. I was thinking about it and all of a sudden, I was in the car and there was a sweet in the spirit. It's like I was, I was taken to a level, in the spiritual level and I begin to hear the voice of God talking about some things, about this deception in the church. But what baffled me is that it go more deeper. It go more deeper than what happens. So it go more more deeper. He explained to me, to me that this is what is happening in the church. That he just wants me to, to see something so that he said he just wants me to see so I can know what is happening in the church right now. Ah, by the special grace of God. I'm going to go a little bit deeper in this deception in the church. It is so, it is so pity, pity that the church has become a place whereby people are not playing hypocrisy. The Lord told me yesterday night, he said to me and he said Sunday to me and to my ear, he said, people have forgotten that he is God. He is not a man. He said, people have forgotten that he is God. He is not a man. He is God that searched all art and all souls. He said, he is the one that searched all art and all souls. He now said something to my ear. He said, tell the people that I will avenge my vengeance is coming upon them. upon them. He said something. He said, because of the damage they have caused in his household, I mean in his in his in his church, and in the household of, of faith, 
He said, I should tell them that his, his anger is coming upon them. Listen to me very well. God mentioned something to me and that thing was so painful to me. He said, my son, he said, do you know, he said, my son, he said, do you know very well that most of these people they give their life to me in lie. They comes out in altar call with lies tongues. Their heart are far from me. He said something to me. He said, it is not everyone who you see that comes out to say, I give my life to Jesus that comes with a true act of repentance. See, many of them just came out. Came out on the, on the, on the point of deceptions. He said, no names will be written in the book of life. Except it is gen they are genuinely repented. He said, right now I am in the point and in the level of vengeance. I'm going to avenge and I'm going to discipline them. He said, I will discipline them on earth. And when they get there on the judgment, I will still discipline them. He spoke this to my ear yesterday night when I was in the car. He was telling me, this include only nine churches where backbiter is 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 their best is their best things they are doing it's so pity that the art of christian are so defined and so dirty so stinking that god begin to regret of some certain things god reveals to me some art of man yesterday and i was so pained it's so pity that those who believe that they are believers are not even a christian at all in the presence of god of god because their life is full of fitting fitting rag deadness is in their heart their life is not right with god they want people to see them as good. Why? God is seeing them as evil inside them. They proclaim to people that they are good, but inside they are bad. They pretend to be good, to be nice. But inside their heart is deceptions of man. Yesterday morning, it just as if God was trying to in fact, throughout yesterday, it's, it's as if God was trying to show me some things. God began to open out of men to me, even in the service. He began to open there. I begin to see it. Do you know that some art have crocodile, uh, crocodile inside them? Some have scorpion inside them. Some is a serpent inside them. And they are holiness Christians, and they are Christian, they are pastors, and they are preaching in the church. They are workers in the church. It's so painful that the church has been destroyed completely. You see, I got to a level, I am just too disappointed. I got to a level, I don't know what to do any longer. I got to a level, I begin to look at what is the church turning into. Ah, I wish. Ah, I wish. Ah, I wish. I have wind to fly. Probably I can be proclaiming this to every year. The judgment of God that is going to befall those who are deceiving themselves. Listen to me very well. You cannot deceive God. You can only deceive yourself. For our God can never be mocked. He can never be deceived. He sees your heart when you are bite-biting. When you are talking to somebody, you are saying a lot of things, bad things about your brother, about your sisters. He's there listening. 
and the judgment will rise up on you if you didn't repent. This is what he told me yesterday. I want you to tell people who are with you so that you can I say, okay, sir. And look at my sister. Let me tell you. It's a good, it's a good. He said, don't tell them. It's true tomorrow. tomorrow. It's so pity. I'm not even talking about people who are not, who are Kana Christian now. Let us leave Kana alone. Kana, we already know that Kana Christians are not children of God. They are not even born again. We are talking about people who believe they are born again. Who believe they are Christians. Who believe they are side of God. Their life is so rough and fitting and they are so I'm, I'm just so 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 painful that the belief god is not saying that i wonder the kind of christianity is in the world this world when you go to deeper life you see the same thing when you go to holiness movement movement you see the same thing you go to redeem it's the same you go to csc is the same which kind of Christianity are we living? Christianity art that their art had been and the fire and death. Those who believe that they are worker for God, many of them are walking in pride. Oh my lap Some people feel that because they are too big. Different kind of things that happen. When are this thing going to stop? Probability God raises his anger. That is when the people eyes will open. God is angry as now. Very angry. He's very angry now. How are we going to take lives? How are we? How are we going to bring lives to Calvary when our own life self doesn't please God? Some will be, will be having grudging heart against his brothers and sisters. Grudging heart. And oh, please, I want to ask, which kind of Christianity is this? Is it the way opposed to Paul did his own and make it. Do you think it's the way the apostles of Christ do their own and they make it? No, 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 no. You can't make heaven like that. Heaven is not people like that. It cannot be people like that. People who are full of pride, who are full of themselves, who believe they are something. Boastfulness. Pride inside their heart. Pride in the soul. Their behavior is so bad and worthless. But to people, they are good. But inside them, they are bad. What is the essence of the laughing? When your inside there is cop is 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 copied, is demonic. It's so pretty. There are some even proof to be a worker, and yet they will still go into meeting. Of the darkness in the night, they will go to witchcraft meeting, money meeting, satanic meetings. Believing God is not saying them. Do you think the eyes of God is so blind? Do you think He didn't see where you are? He knows you. He knows you. He knows you. He knew where you are. But He said to me, "My anger will fall very soon." And when it falls, it is possible mercy will not work out. We are in the land. He wanted to, you might be part of them. He might cleanse you out also. I couldn't sleep overnight. As I'm taking this, I'm taking that, I'm taking this. Especially 
the voice I had yesterday, yesterday night, is giving me ethic. Deception and much in the touch. Plain to be good, but bad. Deception to be Christian when you are a sinner. You are the same person who go and masturbate. You are the same person who go and masturbate. And you are the same person who will play holiness. You are the same person who, who is showing yourself to be perfect. Yet you know yourself. That loss is full of your heart. When is all this going to stop in the touch? When is Christ going to gain our whole heart? Some people's own work is to buy bite. Ah. Hey, you see that brother? <laughs> you just buy biscuits. Now, wow. Now, by biting, gossiping. They just want to know what what is inside your life? I want to, you can't this. You can't go to heaven like this. Your life is fit to rag. Your life is dirty. Your life is dirty. If you think God is not seeing you, you are deceiving yourself. If you think God didn't see you, you have you have you, you have you are a failure. He sees you. He told me yesterday. He was mentioning things and my heart was so bitter. So painful. How can he be in the church of God? How can he be in the church of God? This is where power come to sing. Yet they are having, they are having madness between themselves. They still fight. They still get angry. They have seen anger as a need to take. Grudging of art. Do you even know what it means to grudge? Do you even know what it means to complain? Probably maybe do know. Do you know? Do you even know what it means to more? Do you know that God destroyed and grudges? Complaints. And this kind of life is what you are living. I'm even afraid now. Because most of the Christians are not who we think they are. Pride has been there. Most of all, pride. Walking with pride. Talking with pride. Doing things with pride. When will your life be safe? He spoke to me. And I was, I was so gone. I couldn't share with anybody. He said, I just wanted to see what happened to you. How that pastor disappoint you. I just wanted to see. He said, this is what is happening. He said, I see them all. I just keep quiet. But this is the time of my vengeance. God, God was even telling me a particular person judgment. I said, Lord, it's too much. What are we going to be? How are we going to live our life? When our life is not pleasing to God. When our life is not pleasing to God. Please, let us be very careful. I know you might say, oh, that pastor, in fact, in fact, he's too this, he's too hard, he's too this, his word is not even good at all. Is it that? Whatever you might want to say, say it. But this is the word of God. That must be proclaimed. If you must make ever, you must be holy and completely holy within and without. You might be only without and your dying dear is dead. 
we are in a level where back Christian cannot be. We cannot use, even use Christian as our friend anymore. The Lord will help us in Jesus' name. This is a short message that God gave to me yesterday night. He said, deception in the church. We are not talking of people who are already using the terms. We know them. We know them. Very soon, I'm going to expose something to you. Very soon. About these holiness preachers. Very soon. If God permit me, I will tell you some things. Please be very careful of who you follow. The Lord bless you and the Lord be with you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Please do forget to subscribe and press the notification button. You will be blessed and be anointed in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you. Bye-bye.